Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do another unboxing of an item I have just recently picked up. I have posted the picture of the bag uh, on my Instagram channel uh, saying that I'm gonna un unpack it today and show you what I got. Uh, as you most probably already read on the description, it's a document folder from Prada. So without any further ado, the sound of a paper, white paper bag from Prada is what you hear right now. So here is the bag, this is how it got, uh, they packed the item for me. So a uh, plain white uh, Prada bag, paper bag, quality bag with nice uh, stringy handles. Uh, there is a little bit of plastic that we need to go through in order to reveal this and it came unfortunately or fortunately for that matter um, without a box they didn't have the box in the store where I picked it up but it did come with the with the dust bag which by the way is the same material dust bag um, the same material that I have uh, got the dust bags for my Prada loafers which I reviewed and boxed very recently. So it's a nice velvety kind of very soft material. The drawstrings are exact, exactly the same. Um, has a little Prada sign on the front here. And it's a very, a very nice quality dust bag. So, let's look at this document holder. There we go. Here we go. And, of course, it has to have some problem. There it is. Okay, so as you can see, it's I hopefully this is coming good on this is it's quite a big item this document holder the material used on the outside is the Safiano leather um, both sides and it's done in kind of a red black kind of um, camouflage print which I found uh, very nice uh, the sales associate told me that this is from a line that Prada was doing um, in, I think he told me uh, that it was from the winter fall 2013 collection. Now, I, don't keep me for that, that's just the information that I got, but that's, that's, that's what it is. Nevertheless, I, I really like this item because um, the way that it's done, it's just, it's pure quality. You know, when you, when you touch the item, smell the item or whatever you want to see it's just really really nicely done guys um, so I'm gonna take you around the item a bit so what we have is a big zip on the top which goes all around down to here and on this side there is nothing so it opens from this side down all the way here so it allows you to quickly store whatever you want to store into it uh, from the front you have the traditional Prada triangle logo and another zipper which reveals the outside pocket. This is very useful where you want to put the items that you need to grab very quickly um, to the front to the front pocket. Um, I was able to store just for a reference. I was able to store an iPhone 6 Plus, um, my little card wallet, and a set of keys with a big keychain. Uh, into this front pocket and still still there was place um, just for reference I tried to put my hand into it of course not what's gonna happen okay so one two three it's really deep maybe I try to show it this way I don't know if this is gonna this is gonna do anything or not so it's a really deep pocket really big pocket so you can put a lot of stuff in here so that's on the outside um, the back side, there is nothing that you can, no pockets, no nothing. And 
Then we come to the to the interior. In the interior of this, as I said, it unzips that way. There are some papers inside. I'm gonna get rid of them. And inside of the of of the folder is just a big hole, plus a little pocket here, where you get the care instructions, uh, the little booklet which will tell you, you know how to take care of the item, and your Prada certificate card, which says that this is a material is Safiano Camouflage, color is Bordeaux, and the article number, for anybody who might be interested, is 2VN079. Alright? So, inside, as I said, a big hole, big space for put your, putting your stuff inside, a nice little metallic plaque saying Prada Milano, and a little pocket here. Um, also here on the side, it says made in Italy. A little little stamp like here, and that's it. Um, now, the size of this easily, in my opinion, not that I have here, can hold a 15-inch Mac MacBook easily. Um, I have tried it with a 14-inch. 14-inch um, uh, uh, PC. Uh, I have tried to put my 11-inch MacBook, which is a, you know a joke uh, to put in here because this is really big. Um, and I have tried uh, to put in a 13-inch MacBook Air with a leather cover on top of it, so it's the the air is housed in the leather cover, and still not a problem to put it in here. Easily the computer, easily if you have a, a 13 inch or I, I put in my 11 inch Mac in here, MacBook Air, with the charger uh, without any problem. Okay, so this is gonna keep, you know, you can keep a lot of stuff in here. The inside is really nicely lined with what I believe is cowhide leather. It just, it's definitely leather. I'm not sure it's, is it lambskin or cowhide might be even lambskin for that matter because it's really soft but what I want to you know what I want to highlight guys here is that this is really done nice um, the zippers are real quality it zips supremely easy you know and for what it is I think it's it's really nice now some of the pluses for me on this particular piece and some of the minuses so it looks really, you know, I don't know, it's kind of, I don't have the right outfit for that, but what I want to use it is, I want to use it to, you know, to take it to work, maybe on that days when I'm, you know, kind of dressed more casually, and I want to handheld it, carrying my computer or something like that. So, here is some, you know, it looks nice, it looks elegant, but the downfall of that probably will be that, you know, you need to kind of carry it this way, because there is nothing else that you can, you know, use to hold this, and it might be, you know, a bit unpractical to carry around because of that. Uh, meaning, if you need two hands and you need to do something, I don't know, unlock the garage or whatever you're doing, you might need to set this on the floor or put it between the legs somehow or kind of hit it like that. So that's a bit of an unpractical thing. Second of all, which I already noticed now was when I put a lot of items in this, it becomes very heavy. So it becomes very heavy and it, you know, adds to the... the uh, non-practical aspect of it, but I mean, look at it, it's just gorgeous. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm really excited about this item because I, I really think it's, it's beautiful. Uh, and I'm definitely going to use it even if it's a bit uncomfortable uh, at, at some points. Um, any other things that I might, you know, say about it now? I don't know, I have to start using it. Uh, and I'll see, you know, how it goes day to day, but as I said, it's not going to be used that much. I'm going to use it on certain occasions with certain attire. I don't think it goes with everything. It might go, but, you know, it's better on that days when you're, you know, kind of dressed a bit more edgy and a bit more casual, uh, that this might work really good. I can see this, you know, with some, some jeans, some shirt, which is more casual, you know, maybe casual Friday kind of piece. Uh, for that, I think it's great. Uh, I think it's also great for traveling if you go for uh, maybe a shorter trip and you don't want to carry a laptop bag and you're going to take a carry-on so you can put this in a carry-on. One thing to notice though is guys, 
You can put this in a carry-on, but you will not be able to put this in every bag because it's literally very, very big. Um, um, case in point, in a standard bag that would house a 13 or 15 inch laptop even, you know, in this kind of shape with a handle, this might not go into that bag. So it, I think from that perspective, it's really meant to be carried as a standalone piece and not really put in a laptop bag. Now, if you're traveling and you want to put it in your carry-on, I think that's doable. Uh, and for, for that, it might, you know, suit the purpose nice. Also, it can take a lot of documents. So if you're one of these people that are still um, taking a lot of documents with yourself, paper documents and so on, uh, I'm not, but some people still are and still need that. You can easily take the computer, take the documents, put everything in this, and it's still going to hold. It's that big. That's what I want to tell you. All right, so um, that's uh, a, bit of, a bit of review, uh, a couple of thoughts on this uh, document holder from Prada. Um, I hope you have enjoyed this video, and if you have enjoyed this video, uh, put thumbs up and uh, subscribe. I'm always, you know, will be very, very helpful. It makes me, um, I really appreciate it, uh, and it makes me, you know, do more video for you guys and uh, uh, continue with the, with the channel going on. So, thank you very much for watching this and I hope I will talk to you very very soon. Thank you and bye for now.